I'm Tom Hattrick and today at Makuni Oz we're going to show you the cause and how to fix a swollen rubber Makuni bowl gasket. Okay so this is a problem that pops up every once in a while and some places it's a lot more common than others and as time passes on with uh, different fuel blends it'll just get more prevalent. Uh, your Makuni rubber bowl o-rings basically don't like alcohol. So we've got a picture here, we'll just uh, flash over to that, which is what a customer brought in, showing us uh, how his, uh, as soon as he pulled his bowl off his gasket, it swollen about three or four mil. And, uh, but there is quite an easy fix for it. Generally, when you pull the bowl off, just try and leave the gasket in, as this one here is, you know, straight off a new carburetor, and nothing will happen. But if it does happen to pop out, you've got two ways of fixing it. One thing you'd never do is cut the gasket and try and glue it, that, that's total disaster. You, uh, if you don't have a spare gasket, all you'll do is if the slow one is you're not in a big rush, is go and put the gasket, just leave it out for two days, or you can go and put it in the sun and it'll take one to two days for the alcohol to leach out of it. If you're in a hurry, you need to get going, you wanna go somewhere, go into the kitchen, grab a pot, boil up some water, drop the O-ring into the pot of boiling water, leave it there for about two minutes, the stuff will all leach out and make a little bit of a mess in your pot and you will smell it, uh, and then pick it out of your pot, drop it on air. If it's not quite right, go back, chuck it for another couple of minutes, but it'll just leach it out immediately. The heat, 100 degrees C, uh, boiling point of water is way under the uh, heat range of these rubbers, and it just makes the uh, alcohol come out. So then you'll just drop your gasket back in, and away you go, and it's all good as new.